Good evening guys, I hope you're all doing well. So today I'm going to do a clothing haul from Femilux, if that's even how you say it. Um, I bought myself loads of things and I just felt like I needed like a bit of an autumn winter um, wardrobe change because I basically have nothing for autumn winter. I'm obsessed with summer, that's always how it's going to stay. Um, but I just thought I need to be, I need to look nice this winter, like I'm sick of just wearing anything, absolutely anything, get up in the morning, chuck that on which I probably wore in summer, we just can't be doing that anymore. So I've paired some outfits together, I have bought this much, there is a lot, there is a lot, but I know what shoes I'm putting with what and bags so um without further ado i will get straight with it so first is this jumper that i'm wearing it doesn't look at it it does not fit like i thought it was gonna i literally thought because obviously the model's on like on the thing she i don't think she holds her arms up or if she did i didn't see that photo so i did not realize it was actually as baggy as this and when i was putting it on i was like jesus like how do i even put this on um, but do you know I, I actually quite like it I think it would look really nice with some other stuff that I've bought so later on when I've shown you the rest I will show you a photo so the second thing I bought may as well do it in order I didn't I really so to go with this jumper I bought some black faux leather high-waisted trousers in the colour willow no the black they're called willow apparently um everything I get I think is a size eight if not I'll stay otherwise but if I don't then it's a size eight um so they have cute little pockets on the back and they're just like they look like like normal jeans they've not got any belt holes they've got a little zipper and a button and they are full length so i'm gonna pair that with this jumper some cute beige boots like this color and and a turtleneck underneath this jumper as well so it just gives it that chunky more winter look and then I would probably just pair that with a long black shiny puffer coat. I'll show you the picture here of what I thought would look nice. Um, oh my god, there's a bag stuck to the wall. I put a little turtle neck under this jumper, which I make it think it makes it look really cute and wintry. I'm gonna put like a puffer jacket over this, or maybe like another beige. Don't know because I don't want too many beiges like all mixed together because I do have some brown boots on but they're not the same beige and to be honest I'm not too sure if like they actually go properly but I'll try to show you oh yeah they sort of do to be fair they're not bad so that's the whole fit I think it's so cute These cute little earrings actually are really nice. They're only from Primark for like £1.50. I went and ran running there the other day and got some little cute bits. Um, because they sort of like match the brown tones. So yeah, absolutely love this. Um Whoa no, that does not go. gonna have to live bag free without this one because i don't really want to put a bag with this and to be honest who am i kidding i never even use bags but oh i love the little turtleneck vibes oh it's so cute the white high-waisted pleated ruffle frill bodycon miniskirt wow that is wordy um 
in an eight again. I don't have any of these little like tennis skirts yet, and I think they look really nice with um, a shirt and an oversized jumper. So, oh wow, that is high waisted. I didn't think it would be as high waisted as that, but um, that's what that looks like. And I hope that looks nice. I'm gonna put that with a white oversized um, button up shirt with a collar that I already have. Well, it's my dad's, but. And I've finally got one of these Pinterest girl vest jumpers. In fact, I don't even know if I got a vest or a jumper. Sorry about that. I got a white and black oversized hand tooth sleeveless or uh, sleeveless so I did get like a vest type one Um, why did I do that I wanted a why did I do that well hopefully it looks nice Um, and I'll just pair it with some trainers Um, and probably I don't know what bag you'll just see in the photo so this is me in the chunky knit jumper and the skirt. Um, definitely not something that I would normally wear, but it's actually a vibe, you know, like I actually quite like it. So there with a cute little back bag, so it all matches. And some, well, glow in the dark um, shoes, but I do actually quite like it. When I first put it on, I was thinking, wow, no, that's really not me. Um, but now, <laughs> I like it a lot more. Though I'm not sure about the bag of it to be honest because the chain's gold so get rid of that. I'll get a gold one. So next we have this cute little stone plunge front sleeveless slinky crop top. You really can't do without enough crop tops can you really so that's it's a v-neck or a rounded neck i'm just like, i don't even know i can't remember what i put in my basket um so that with this lovely checkered jacket i've got myself a jacket this year yeah i've only been buying like shirts um so navy check print oversized button up pocket jacket you know exactly what this is going to look like nearly every single girl has one this winter um I did get one from Lasula? No. Somewhere. I don't think it was Lasula. And I just was not impressed with the quality at all. Like when I say oversized, wow. It was too much, too much. So that with the. Oh gosh, nearly knocked you all over. I do that every time. Um, them two together with. In fact, I've not decided if I'm going to put some nice jeans with it yet. It depends if these look nice. I've never ever tried Femilux jeans. In fact, I've never bought jeans online where I couldn't have tried them on in store first. So, yes, I have Zara and they fit really nice actually, but I'm really hoping that these fit nice too because I've seen them on the model and they did look really nice. So I got the light blue stone wash ripped jeans in Stevie. Um... I'll show you them quickly. So they where did I say the skinny jeans? No. So I think they're just like a little bit more of a mum style baggy jean. The rips are like proper proper rips, and they're like straight at the bottom. So we'll see what they look like. And they, are, they do look quite high waisted to be honest. So I'm hoping. So I'll either put the jacket and the crop top with the jeans or I might keep them with some normal gory joggers because I think that would be like a nice comfy um, outfit. So this is the oversized jacket, which I absolutely love. To be honest, I think it's just the right length. Like if I won, I could button it up and it would like be okay. But obviously I'm not gonna. Also, yeah, it's hard see through, but this is the nude top. I just have to wear like a nude brow of it, but I do actually really like how it comes in here and then goes down. I think that's really nice and it like 
compliments you. So I am actually going to pair this jacket with the jeans just because I can't pair the, the denim jacket with the jeans so I'll do that now. I don't think I'm going to send the looks A. Okay. This is the issue we have and it was really hard to actually get them on as well like you can see how skin tight they are on them bad boys i mean i will be able to zip it up now i actually have them on but i'm already concerned on if i'm going to be able to squeeze out those things maybe i might have to sleep in them tonight okay the zip don't want to work anyway jesus i mean they do bits for the waist but that was just a bit of a struggle if i'm honest but oh my god i love them though if Okay, I might swap these for a 10 and then if they're all right, I think we're good because oh, I really like them, but I feel like I'm in a corset, oh my Jesus. So I'll also obviously show you pictures as well if, if you think like you can get a better idea off of photos, like I'm probably like that to be honest, like because obviously people stand differently and stuff like that, but this outfit is a vibe and even though the blues like obviously because it's completely different it works so just before I move on to the next outfit I thought I'd show you like what it all looks together from a little bit further back um so please mind the mess on the floor if you can see it but I will try not to get it in so like there with the shoes I actually really like the flares I like that they only just cover but wow they're so tight but I'm definitely going to get these in a 10 because I do really love them um yeah that's the outfit Bye. lastly I got this lovely oversized blue light wash zip up drawstring denim jacket I've seen this on the website for ages and it's been in my, in my wish list for ages and I thought you know what oh gosh just get it so I have and I'm hoping it's as nice on because I really I really loved it on the model um oh it does look quite nice that wow really oversized done it? it is a size eight um well, you can see how it compares to how skinny I am. So brilliant. It may look a tad oversized. And I also haven't decided, in fact, yeah, I'm definitely not putting this with jeans. This will definitely go with probably a chunky jumper underneath, but like a hoodie and, and some tracksuit bottoms. So back again. Now I am trying on the oversized uh, denim jacket and let me turn it down just a tiny bit. I love it absolutely how I wanted it to be. It's all fun and games until you like every single thing. Love that. So I have paired it with some grey jogging bottoms and just a black hoodie underneath. Um, just for a chilled vibe, I have no shoes on but I probably just wear chunky trainers, quite a chilled going shopping look or something like that with a cute bag maybe, this little number just to match the jumper. So, we have an issue because I love every single thing. All of our outfit, outfits were practically wholly done by Femilux. Apart from the super dry shoes, the brown boots, and obviously the tracksuit bottoms. Um, so, that is it. That is the end of my vlog. I really, really hope that you've liked today's haul. Please let me know if you'd want more hauls in the future or what companies you'd even want it from. Femilux was just like my go-to because I absolutely love all of their stuff. 
um but yeah i hope you're all safe please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in my next one